Hello everybody, welcome back to Let's Play Persona 5. In the last episode, we finally got back to this game. We also hung out with Ryuji a bunch. We hung out with uh, our very special caretaker. We bought a TV. It got delivered. And uh, this episode, I think we're going to start it off by talking with Shojiro. Hey, so you're brewing coffee? Hey, are you brewing coffee? I taught you how, so go ahead and give it a try. <laughs> well, if you want help out. If you want to help out, I'm fine with that. What are you going to do? Hmm. Well, I mean, I might as well just All help right, out then. a bit. What's the worst that could happen? Shojiro's guidance is extremely precise. I just do as he told me. I don't think my bond with Shojiro will deepen just yet. It might take Thanks. a few more hangouts. Hey, thanks for helping me out. No problem. Alright, loading. Sunday. Sunday, Sunday, Sunday. It's a fun day. For Sunday. <sighs> of course, I was... Of course, waiting is pretty boring. I wonder what Ryuji and the rest are up to. Oh, well. You got plans today? I still can't just sit around doing nothing. I'm at the arcade in Shibuya. Let me know if you, anything comes up. Uh, let me go right away. Why the heck not? He's a good friend. I mean, this talk. Oh, hey. Maybe Kamashin and all, but I'm still feeling kind of nervous. I guess we gotta wait and see what happens. Hmm. Can't use that spot behind the gym today, so what do you want to do? Oh darn. Uh, let's hang yeah. out. Go on a date. Let's go somewhere fun. Yeah. I think I'd probably pick a, pick somewhere with good food if, we're, if it were up to me. Selecting a hangout spot. When you learn about hangout spots, you can go there with one of your conf... Whatever. Hangout spots can be selected from the map. Each con confident has their own preferences. Keep that in mind when visiting Spy with the Confidence. He likes this place. Let's go. Oh, the ramen place. Sure. Let's go. I'm pretty hungry. You love noodles. Slip, slip, sliding down your throats. Whoa! The hell? Line even longer than last time. Put an ad out or something? We're gonna. We're gonna look like we're just going for the new fad. My stomach's already in ramen mode. Come on, let's get in line. <laughs> ah, super freaking good. Down to the last drop. The stuff's worth eating, no matter the weight. Ain't you totally falling for this soy sauce flavor too? Ah. I'm in love. Right? Right, Tokyo guys are all over this stuff. You're one of us now. Anyways, thanks for asking me here today. I'm all cheered up now because of you. Come on, let's get going. There's tons of people waiting for our seats. Hey. Looks like they're giving out presents. Here, you can have mine. Oh. Sweet. I'm not crazy enough about ramen to be showing that off in my room. I feel like my bond with Ryuji will grow stronger soon. Yeah! Alright, let's run off to the station and work off that meal. Radical! It's evening now. Hey! Tomorrow's the board meeting. Don't worry, I'm sure the change of heart will... The change of heart worked. Oh. The board meeting's tomorrow, right? We're kind of... We're gonna get expelled if Kamoshida doesn't have a change of heart by then. We did all we could. Either way, I'm not gonna lose hope. You're right. It's a little too early to be giving up now. Guess we're gonna find out one way or another tomorrow. We just gotta brace ourselves for all the possibilities. Sorry. I can't offer more reassurance, but he should have a change of heart. 
Let's just believe in that while we wait for tomorrow. Oh. We could chat with Sir. Mm -hmm. Go study or read a book if you have time to kill. Time is money, don't waste it. Well, I guess let's study. Now listen up. Yep. Make sure you close up. Later, Shojiro. Gotta study for tomorrow. Wow! Wow, you can all answer these difficult problems. You're amazing. Alright. We did it. What are your it. thoughts? Seems like you were able to get a lot of studying <laughs> done. Awesome. Point up. Alright. Yep. Don't tire yourself out if you keep at it too long. You should stop for today and get some sleep. Thanks for the guidance, Super Cat. Alright, guys. Let's see what today brings us. <sighs> this is what no is good. Our, such a drag. Why couldn't they give us today off too? We have the rest of the week up. We have the rest of the week off starting tomorrow. Yeah, it's ridiculous. Speaking of, what's with call that calling card? The one sent to Kamoshida. Didn't it say something about stealing his distorted desires or something weird like that? Yeah, something like that. I'm sure it's just a prank. No one's taking it seriously. Take your time. Ah, <sighs> freaking loading game. What's with the sudden morning assembly? I bet it's about that girl that jumped the other day. They don't have to tell us not to commit suicide. There was that weird calling card too, so I guess the teachers are freaking out. We're lucky that morning practice got canceled, though. I feel like I'm gonna faint if this takes forever. <sighs> Let's begin this school-wide morning assembly. As you all know, a tragic event took place the other day. Thankfully, we have been informed that she has pulled through, but it will take time until she recovers. Everyone here has a bright future ahead. I implore that you rethink the importance of life and... Mr. Kamashita, what's the... I... have been reborn. That is why I will confess everything to you all. Huh? What's wrong with Mr. Kamashita? What's this about? Confess? Did the volleyball team do something? I have repeatedly done things that were... Unbecoming of a teacher, verbally abusing students, physically abusing my team, and <sighs> sexually harassing female students. I am the reason why Shiho Suzui tried to kill herself. Sexual harassment? What? Why would he oh, say that himself? Uh, he is so team? first. Really? Physical abuse? I thought of this school as my own castle. There were even students that I sentenced to expulsion simply because I didn't like them. I will, of course, rescind those. I am truly sorry for putting innocent youths through such horrible acts. I am an arrogant, shallow, and shameful person. No, I'm worse than that. I will take responsibility. I kill myself for it. What? Did he just say that? Would kill himself? Mr. Kamoshida is, um, not well. Mr. Kamoshida, please died. get off the stage for now. Everyone, return to your classes. I... Don't run, you bastard! Shiho's still alive. Even after all the things that made her want to die! You have no right to run from this! You're right. You're absolutely right. I should be punished under the law and atone for my crimes. I did horrible things to Takamaki-san as well. In return for giving Suzui-san a position on the team, I... I tried to force her into having relations. 
Disgusting. <sighs> For a position on the team? It feels so That's bad horrible. for talking so the rumors son. weren't true. As of today, I will resign from my position as an instructor and turn myself in. <laughs> Someone please call the police! The police? Is he for real? He's gonna get wow. arrested? This morning's assembly is over. Return to your classes immediately! Isn't this just like what that calling card said? Does this mean the Phantom Thieves thing was for real? Was something done to Kamoshida? Come on, there's no way you could steal someone's heart. But why else would he start saying things like he'll kill himself or turn himself in? Maybe because it almost got leaked? Don't they go easier on you if you turn yourself in? I wonder what happened. Who knows? <laughs> but man, Kamoshida turned out to be one sick bastard. Hey, is this for real? He's turning himself in just like that? What's going to happen this to the ball? Think Tom Marazzi will show up? This now? is gonna be a big Return to your classrooms at once! His heart really did change. Seems like it. But was this really for the best? <sighs> I don't know. I gotta agree. I ain't so sure either. Huh? What the? Takamaki san, I'm sorry. Huh? We all knew, but we pretended we didn't. Takamaki san, I had you all wrong. I'm sorry that I spread rumors about you. I didn't know at all. Kamashita was forcefully pushing himself on you. It must have been so hard for you. I'm sure there's a ton of people who want to apologize to you. We're so sorry. No, it's okay. The same goes for me, too. Besides, that's all in the past now. Hey, you there! Return to class at once! Well, see you later then. I can't apologize enough for what I did to you. I swear I'll make it up to you someday. You got it, bud. Looks like Kamoshida ain't the only one that had a change of heart. Man, I'm glad for you. Looks like those weird rumors are gonna go away. My thing doesn't really matter. We made Kamoshida apologize about Shiho. That's more than enough for me. You should hurry and tell her about it then. Yeah. Awesome. I totally freaked out. He really did have a change of heart. And we were lucky his mind didn't get messed up either. <laughs> this was an A-plus job. Does this mean that they won't have a mental shutdown even if their palace disappears? I see. So we need to persuade the shadow without killing it and then send it back to its real self. Our targets won't undergo a cognitive collapse if we do that. So we can get him to confess with no bad stuff? Hey, that works for me. I don't know, it seems a little too convenient. Do you have convenient. to be so loud? Eh, don't worry about it. So, how'd it go? With Shiho, I mean. She's regained consciousness. Woo! For real? It was only for a little bit, but I got to talk to her. I was able to tell her that Kamoshida admitted to what he did. Shiho, she... She told me she was sorry. Looks like she found out that I was flirting with Kamoshida for her sake. And here I was, wanting to apologize to her. Kamoshida's at fault for all this. I know. Shiho's mom is thinking of transferring her to another school after she recovers. The whole sexual harassment and attempted suicide... People will label her after that. Sounded like Shiho had the same idea, too. Ah, it's gonna get lonely. But I think it's for the best. I'm sure it'll be hard if she stays here. She's alive. You can see her anytime. I need to change too. 
That aside, I was surprised you could hold yourself back against Kamoshida's shadow. It wasn't like that. I just wanted Kamoshida to apologize himself. You're so kind, Lady On. No matter how much of a shitbag he was, finishing him off would have left a bad aftertaste, huh? Huh? That's not it. I think revenge is better served if I make him repent. Realizing what he's done, he'll grovel for forgiveness the rest of his life. You know? I just believe there are fates worse than death. Yeah. Holy shit. Uh, anyways, that's all settled. But, you know, there was one more thing I was wondering about that castle. Why was Kamoshida the only one who had that metaverse thing? It isn't necessarily limited to him. It's something anyone could have, if their heart became warped from their desires. Anyone? Wanna check it out? Not right now. We better lay low for a while. People are still gonna be talking about Kamoshida. Then again, it's totally impossible for someone to find out what we did at his palace. Yeah, about that, weird rumors about you guys are already going around. Stuff like you got together and threatened Kamoshida with something close to physical violence. What the hell? Oh man. People aren't going to easily believe that phantom thieves really exist. Calling cards being treated like it was a prank by someone who knew what Kamoshida was doing. Hmm. Makes sense. We're the ones who did it, and I still don't completely believe it myself. <laughs> let's wait for things to settle down for the time being. Anyways, let's check how much this metal can be sold for. It'd be better if we pawned it off ASAP. Ooh, got a hit! Wait, 30,000 yen? That's all a gold medal's worth? Remember that time in middle school? I lent you some money. There's no way I borrowed 30,000 yen from you. Wouldn't it be around that much with compounded interest? Interest my ass! <laughs> I'm not saying that I'm taking all of it. I mean, it's your fault for not paying me back all these years. It's just common sense. Ah, damn it. <laughs> I agree on laying low and keeping an eye on the situation. However, you dragged me into this. It would be nonsense not to celebrate a successful mission. I guess we could blow this dirty money on something fun. Discussions among phantom thieves are to take place over luxurious food. How about it? Hey, wait! Ah, uh, I guess it's fine. There's somewhere I want to go then. Where's that? It's a place Shiho and I have been wanting to go for a while. I owe money, so I can't complain. You don't have it yet. You good with that? Yeah. Still gotta sell it. God. Ah, fine by me. We deserve it. I'll leave it to your discretion as well, Lady On. I'll call and check the prices later then. When should we go? Want to do it soon, like tomorrow? Why don't we go on the last day of the holidays? It'll help energize us when school life starts up again the day after. Then, uh, the 5th, on Children's Day. So, who's going to sell this? Leave that to us. We know a store that'll buy anything, don't we? Okay, we do. I'll leave that to you guys. What store are you referring to? Ah, you're back. Beep, 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 beep. Is that gold medal real? When did it get inside his palace? I don't think that's it. No, that one is a fake. It's just a byproduct of his... God. Yeah. That girl is so pretty easy, huh? I won't forget about my debt. <laughs> 500 yen is not a lot. I mean, for real school. Kamashita will never be proud of that once-in-a-lifetime gold medal ever again, depending on how you... 
depending on how you took it, that punishment might have even been worse than death for him. <sighs> Must be nice to have time off starting tomorrow. For me, it just means more customers and even more work. What store is he referring to? Is he referring to the, like, recycling place back here? Because he might be referring to this place. What would you like? Nope. Not talking about that. Ah, a bundle of silk yarn. That's a lot of money for yarn. Ah. Uh, That's what I'm talking about. Ah. Well, I mean, we can drink. Do you still just drink in here? Do you have to drink? Just going around, taking baths every day. Freaking what a guy. What a man. What a hero. Kind of want to study. Do you like celebrate your success, sell the medal? Now listen up. Study. Make sure you close up. Can do, showed your all. San. Hey, hey. What are your <laughs> thoughts? We got two more. Point up. All right. Yep. I just want to level up my skills because it sucks when you like want to do something and you can't because the game's like well I mean you're not that smart so you chose B okay come on we're going to pawn that metal today hey you can hear me right you don't have any plans do you come help me out instead of sleeping your life away we do owe it to him We'll just have to wait. Hurry up down and help him out. Alright. Let's help out Shojiro. <sighs> Sorry I kind of pressured you into doing this. Now, on to our next topic. Fall from Grace, the story of a dishonored Olympic medalist. Just recently, a high school coach admitted to his school that he had been perpetually abusing students. Given his prior Olympic achievements, this has caused quite the stir. What caused this habitual offender to suddenly confess these heinous crimes to his entire school? The police are hoping that the upcoming interrogations will bring light to this question. Mm -hmm. hmm. Isn't this... My friends would come back from practice with bruises all the time. It was scary. But I'm relieved that the abuse is finally going to end now. He would touch me and stuff all the time. I'm glad I don't have to deal with that sexual harassment anymore. There were always rumors, sure. Not many people believed them, though. Like, I'm totally shocked they were actually true. At least I can go to school without worrying. Hey. I knew it. This is your school, isn't it? like it. Jeez. Things might be getting troubles turbulent at school, but you need to just keep your head down, alright? More importantly, keep those hands moving. I've got some more stuff I need you to do. Yes, Shojiro. Evening already. <laughs> Chief really worked us hard. <sighs> Did you see? It was on the news. No way the school's gonna be able to play dumb after that. I saw it too. Sh Sh Shiho's name didn't come up, right? Not that I saw, I bet they wanted to keep that part quiet. I'm so glad. It's finally over then. All we gotta do now is eat some tasty stuff and put all this crap behind us. I'm totally looking forward to that celebration party. I'll try not to let you guys down. All right, we need to sell the gold medal tomorrow. Even if the chief wants your help, make sure you turn it down, okay? <sighs> hey, actually, you're never gonna get to sell it, and it's gonna be a hilarious thing. Isn't it? Isn't it? 
Make sure to do the dishes. When I get back. Just do it. Don't get cocky with me. Welcome. Oh. Am I interrupting something? No, Not I don't think so. The cause of the runaway train incident in the subway the other day still has not been found. Police are hurrying to solve the matter as it may relate to the rise in psychotic breakdown incidents. Oh, is that the thing everyone's been talking about? Doesn't it make you curious? People who were living normal lives suddenly went mad or deranged out of the blue. Not to mention that it's happening one after another. Could they really be coincidental? Hmm. Leaving that aside, what do you have? I'll have the house blend, please. Are you a part-timer? I'm surprised this place can afford one. Th that's exactly the case. Are you a high school student? Where do you attend? I send Shujin a cat. Oh, someone I know goes there as well. I've heard that things are rough right now. A, a teacher named Kamoshida confessed his crimes like he was a completely different person, supposedly. And it happened all of a sudden one day. Can a person's mental state change so easily? I mean, it huh. might be able to. <sighs> Is my drink ready yet? Coming right up. Get Rex Shojiro. The dishes can be done later! Shall we go? All right, today's the day we turn that metal into cash. You know that place I'll bite off, right? What is he talking about? Somewhere. What? Ah. It'll be here, I guess. Is he referring to the model store? I have no idea what he's referring to. Is he talking about the gun place? Hmm? So this is the place. Looks like it. Let's just take care of this. Wait, we don't have to search for it yet. Just be patient. I'm sure we'll get one soon enough. They never think about running off down this narrow alley. Uh-oh. Uh-oh! Huh? Uh, what do you want? I want you to buy this. Huh, a gold mallet? Metal? Why do you have this? You don't buy any fake or stolen goods here, kid. Hey! Hold on a sec, let me see it. I'm just not gonna ask where you got this. Has three th thirty thousand yen sat for it though. Works for me. Thirty thousand is. All right. It's almost time. Here, take this with you. So thanks for selling me that metal. But uh. Best not open it. Just bring it with you next time you come back here. It's inside. It's all fine, trust me. They're here. Machina. Yaoi. Yes, there are some matters we'd like to discuss with you today. Go, kid. Know why we're here? <laughs> I don't know. Looking for evidence? You tell me, Detective Son. Watch your attitude. Well, you guys are gonna search me. Go on, do what you gotta do. What was that? An upstanding citizen supposed to cooperate with the cops, right? Hey, you sure this lead was legitimate? I could have sworn it was. <laughs> Can't you hurry it up? We got business to run here. Bad person. Hey, you. What's in that bag? Show me. The kid's just a regular old customer. You can check the tapes if you want. That'll convince you. That'll show everything that's gone down here today. 
I don't want to be seen here with the detective see the footage of me with that gold medal. I should leave. I won't let you get away. Easy. Show us what's in that bag. It's none of your business. Okay. <laughs> I said show it to me. Hey. You're talking to that kid, remember? Besides, he's not the one we're here to see. Ugh. That's right, Detective Son. Maybe next time try not harassing my customers. See how that goes. See ya. Safe trip home, kid. Uh oh. Uh oh. That could be bad. Mm. What are the detective doing in there? More importantly, aren't you curious about what's in the bag? Maybe a little. Well. Okay. Come on, let's open it up. Hey, wait! Oh. <laughs> Miles ahead of the one Ryuji you had. That's something weird about that place. Hey, hey! Hey, Elijah. I just had a great idea. You should totally buy this gun from him later. I mean, it's perfect. Something like something this real looking would work wonders in the metaverse. Anyway, he told us to bring it back next time you came, right? Now's our chance! We should try striking a deal with him when we go to return it. Paper bag! Huh. Anne's calling me. Oh, hello, it's me. I saw the news, you know, about Kamoshida. It's getting a lot of coverage. How do you feel? I don't know. The reaction's been bigger than what I was expecting. I guess I'm just surprised. Uh, I don't think we did anything wrong, though. I wonder if we helped those people speak up about it. It's possible. That's pretty amazing, huh? I didn't think we'd actually be able to do it. And yet, look at us now. This calls for celebration. Let's meet in front of Shibuya Station at noon tomorrow. Don't be late. Oh, and did you pawn off that medal? You didn't forget, right? I'll tell you later. Huh? Why? Oh, I get it. It's because you sold it for even for a lot more than we were expecting, isn't it? You should really be excited about the place I chose, by the way. I'm sure everyone's gonna love it. Well, see you guys tomorrow. <laughs> ah, a restaurant of Lady Anne's choosing. Finally, a decent meal. Hey, what do you think we're gonna be eating? I'm hoping barbecue. Ooh, I could go for some Wangu beef. It's be it better be grade A. <laughs> In any case, I'm surely looking forward to it. <laughs> Shut up, facade. Okay. Big celebration tomorrow. Let's get some sleep. I mean, we could sleep or we could train. Or we could train. Or we could train. <laughs> tomorrow, I can't wait. Why can't we do anything today? Thursday. All right. Mmm, <laughs> so good. <laughs> so good. No. No wonder Lady Han chose this place. Of course it's good. This is a famous hotel after all. Oh yeah. I heard that the police are coming to interview some people at school. That's troublesome. Our names are gonna come up for sure. People are spreading all sorts of rumors about us and Kamoshida. But we got them pumped up. I keep hearing stuff like the Phantom Thieves really stole his heart. I think most people don't believe it, but some of them actually seem grateful. Look at this. The Phantom Aficionado website? 
Well done, Phantom Thieves. Now I can keep going too. Thank you for giving us hope. Pretty cool, huh? I was just desperate to deal with my own problems, but seeing people saying all this feels... strange. Yeah. Hey, what do we do now? I mean... We plan on eating? Well, of course I'm gonna eat, but... <gasps> this place has a time limit! Oh crap! We only got an hour to eat! Just 50 minutes left! God, I'm not gonna finish all the beef dishes at this pace! I need to eat my way through the entire dessert menu! Look after our stuff. We'll snag something for you guys, too. Don't worry. Alright. Oh, man. God melts in my mouth. Seriously? Only meat? Now, where should I start? And she's all about the cake. So happy! <laughs> Look at that hey, sandwich. Calories. Shut up! How much do you think one of these costs? I'll never get the chance to do this again! Mm, the Wilton Hotel Cake Buffet! I'd heard rumors, but I never thought it'd be so amazing! <laughs> and where's our share? I didn't really know what you'd want, so I just grabbed you some beans. Beans? There were some pretty bizarre things there, too, so we got you a variety of those. Fried bananas, preserved eggs, and some kind of beans. M more beans? We put so much on the plate that it got all mixed up. But it should probably still taste good. It's gonna be full beans. This is just plain grotesque. Let's go. These two just don't know what fine dining means. We'll show them. Leave it to me. That's reassuring. You guys watch our things while we're gone. Wait patiently for our return. Mm. Oh, it's like a meaty explosion in my mouth. Oh, this part's cream cheese! They're not even listening. How silly. As I'd expect from the buffet at the top class hotel, the ingredients and variety of dishes are crazy good. There's a reason it costs eight thousand yet. I have a lot here, but fish should come first. Let's fill our plate with all sorts of fish. Which table do you think they are at? Uh fish would probably be back here, I guess. Can we not go back there? Um, it's out. Less fish. Look, there's fish. I prefer it raw, but grilled is great too. Hey, have you heard, my dear? The news about Kamoshita, fellow absolute dreadful. Ah, right, as a teacher of Shujin Academy caught doing such indecent acts. Shameful, really. Hold on a sec. They still haven't managed to solve those horrible psychotic breakdown episodes, have they? I wish they wouldn't let themselves be distracted by such towardly scandal. Perhaps it's a sign of how peaceful this country is. I honestly pity the, those poor Shojin students, though. Huh, it sounds like Kamoshida incident is the talk of the town! Shoot, they noticed you. Just grab some food and react natural. On the plus side, we'll get to eat the food later. How did a child like this end up here? I certainly hope he didn't bring friends. I prefer my meals to remain hooligan free. Thank you very much. Come on, let us go. <sighs> What's so bad about kids coming to enjoy a buffet? I wonder what the other people here. How the other people here are reacting to the news. Let's get some more food and listen up. Maybe there'll be more people that can eavesdrop at the other table. Hey, figure it'll be a problem if they figure out where you should drop it, so let's pretend to get some food. There are some meat dishes nearby. So they're 
ratings for the news, which were really that good, it was because it was about that teacher who sexually harassed his student. Huh? Was it Kamoshida? It's about how you f frame it. You've got to be... You got to cater to the idiotic public. Ratings go up when you show them crude, sensational news and make it easy for them to understand. How can he be so insensitive? A student almost killed herself because of that Kamoshida. By the way, do you think these student... These sudden changes of heart might be real? Well, that's... Quick, grab some food! And don't forget about the crispy bits. So, because he had a sudden change of heart, he just confessed all of his crimes? Uh, who knows? Sorry, but it's time I have to go. I'll call you again after the meeting. Sorry, it's a sudden change of heart, huh? I suppose I can't blame him for seeing it that way. I wonder how the other people here are reacting to the news. Let's get some more food and listen up. Ah, meet Ryuji, but a... I'm no Ryuji, but a meal is not the same if you don't have any. Got distracted. He should have just accepted his lot in life and quietly done his job as a teacher. I'm not... It's not even an incident we can take seriously. The whole story is pretty ridiculous. We should just probably look into it. But... We can also just let the low-ranking scrubs handle it. Look into? I guess they're investigating Kamoshida. They don't sound very enthusiastic about it, though. Hmm? Ah, grab some food! Ah, get that part, it's not too fatty. He's going to be arriving soon. We don't want to keep him waiting, so we better get going. What's he going to discuss with the higher-ups? Well, well, I'm sure it's more important than lunch. I wonder how the other people here are reacting to the news. Let's grab some more food and listen. Ah, no dis... Giant dessert! Up close, it looks even bigger and more delicious. This giant sweet... Ah! I got distracted! News travels quick. It's already all over the internet. You know, the story about how Kamoshida got his ass kicked by the some world reforming heroes? It doesn't sound like a serious story to me. Some of the details are pretty far-fetched. Don't worry about it. We just have to do what they tell us to do. It all... It's all rumors that made made up by school kids. Anyway, if it's gripe, gripping news, who cares if it's not true? So they don't believe themselves, but they're making up stories to make the Phantom Thieves seem real. And they're doing this in front of the actual Phantom Thieves. Ah, yeah, protect the fast food. Uh, get sure lots of whipped cream. What's wrong? Oh, it's nothing. It's... I just thought some weird kid was looking at us, that's all. Why don't we go? It's almost time for a meeting. Well, that was rude. Did you hear them? How they said we were weird? I didn't think there was anyone else who could listen on. But it's shocking. So many of the adults here don't seem like nice people. Now, according to what we heard, it seems most adults aren't very interested in the news about Kamoshida. Well, it's about him. Well, now that we've got a nice variety of food on our plates, let's head back to the others. Huh. Oh! You brought a ton back. What do you think about coming up against uh, such ritzy food? I just want to eat. I was thinking that too, but take a bite. Using better ingredients makes stuff taste way different. Man! Look at you acting like you have a refined palate all of a sudden. Wait! Don't you think you're eating too much, Mana? There's no knowing when we'll get to come here again. <sighs> sure, but you guys brought back lots of food. It'd be a shame to let any of it go to waste. Why don't you help them out, Ryuji? We should both help. No. No, it's our food! Get stuff in your face with cake. Damn it. Whatever, Elijah and Morgana, let's deal with this ourselves. No! It's our food. Feels like no matter how much we eat, the amount of food we have stays the same. <sighs> Still more? Don't give up, let's keep at it. <sighs> we did it. 
My belt feels multiple sizes too small. Yeah. It's a victory for all of us. Is this a game to you? That was a breeze. Is your stomach the size of a freaking palace? <laughs> Good job. You guys have about the last one last dish to cleanse your palates. I recommend the seasonal tart. The grapefruit has both alluring sweetness and tangy sourness. Stop, I don't want to hear about sour stuff. Blah. This isn't good. I gotta use the bathroom. <sighs> me too. Please carry me gently. Wait. My, look at that table. They must not normally have the opportunity to eat, eat such exquisite food. I can only imagine what their parents must look li be like. Huh? What was that? Ugh. Damn it. We don't got time for that. Come on, let's go. Ugh, I'm stuffed. I totally panicked when I saw the closed for cleaning sign at the bathrooms. You were talking big about eating until you puked, but you really did puke. Are you some kind of moron? Hey, same goes for you. What floor was that restaurant on? We came up to get here, so it has to be on a lower floor, right? There's still no update on the case. Not yet. Excuse me, but why are you so involved? It's not something you should be concerned with. I don't care about your opinion, you incompetent buffoon. When I say pick up the pace, you do it! Hey, you're cutting in line! What do you want? No! What do you- No! What are you- Ah! We're in a hurry. Oh, I'm sorry. So you can butt in front of other people if you're in a hurry? It seems the customer base has changed since I was here last. Have they started a daycare? What? Sir, we don't have time for this. I know. Don't bother with them. Just now. Well, I guess he might be important. What the hell with that bossy guy? Shouldn't we head back down? Yeah, but that dick really pissed me off. He wasn't even hiding the fact that he looks down on everyone. Don't lose your temper over this. I just can't forgive shitty adults like that. Man's voice. It sounded almost like the one from back then. What's wrong? Don't worry about it. That's just gonna make me worry more, you know. Yeah, I know. That's I bet I it's it. because he rarely eats well. I'm always stuck with canned cat food too. Yeah, that sir bullshit makes me sick. Damn it! Huh. Interesting. Interesting. Very interesting. What took you so long? Poop. Why are you all pissy? Sorry. I had a run in with some woman a second ago. She bumped into me, but then said it was all my fault when she dropped her plate. <laughs> Sounds like a real bitch. Yeah. Thanks, though. But the restaurant workers all looked at me with this disapproving expression. I gotta disapprove us. I wonder we're if rich. we're out of place here. <clears throat> hey, Morgana. What is it? Anyone could have a palace, yeah? Anyone with a strong, distorted desire. 
Same for them having a change of heart if their treasure gets stolen. That would be the case. Why are you bringing this up all of a sudden? We had trouble earlier too. These selfish shitheads who just look down on everyone else. I was just wondering if we'd be able to change those kinds of people too. You mean, you want to continue as the Phantom Thieves? I've been thinking. We put a lot of work into changing Kamoshida's heart, but nobody believes in the Phantom Thieves. Plus, those guys who had no other choice but to just deal with it are thanking us. Us, of all people! There are a lot of victims. I... I agree. If we ignore people who are in trouble, I'd go back to being the same as I was before. Well, that's true. You're under my tutelage. There's nothing we can't accomplish as phantom thieves. Shouldn't we be able to help him out? I didn't even think of such a possibility. But it's true. That with that power, we may be able to help people out. But that means we'll have to fight shadows again, doesn't it? Yeah. Indeed. That can't be avoided. Eh, I'm sure we'll manage. <laughs> right? Fi uh, fine by me. Huh. Even if you guys are still just fledglings, this means we're an actual organization now. Fledglings? <laughs> That's actually pretty fitting for us. All right, it's settled. We're gonna catch all these shitty adults by surprise and make ourselves known to the world. Are you okay being our leader? Of course. It's me. No leader. objections here. I can't handle all that responsibility stuff. Where's my say in this? But Lady Ann made the recommendation, so I'll allow it. Well, should we decide on a name for our group? I just went with Phantom Thieves of Hearts last time, but don't you think a real name would be cooler? Ooh, I've got it. I want it to be something both cute and luxurious sounding. Let me see. <gasps> How about the diamonds? <laughs> I'm getting the real Little League baseball feel from it. Well then, here's my suggestion. How about Tilefish Poilet? Tile... uh... what? That's what I ate earlier. It's commemorative, no? Oh no, you idiot! Uh, you decide for us. Team name may be seen by others when using network services. Please be cautious not to enter any personal information for the board. Do not enter a name that could be considered offensive. Hmm. We are the heartthrobs. Because we steal huh. hearts and That's we're not all, bad at all gorgeous. A good name. For a rookie. Yeah. We going with that? That's okay. Well, now that the name's set, who's our next target? There are tons of rotten adults and all. Why not just stick to targeting big names? CEO? Yeah, something along those lines. If we go after some bigwig, it's gotta get on the news, right? Don't you think more people would believe in us if we did that? That's not a bad idea. For you, Ryuji. Being so mean. If we become better known, we might be able to give courage to a lot more people. I don't really like the idea of just picking someone out of the blue, though. Let's narrow it down to someone we can all agree on, then. Hmm. So we need a big wig we decide on unanimously. I like that.
like that unanimous decision part. It's like we're making some kind of pact. Now then, this is the official formation of the Phantom Thieves organization. Oh no! Our time for the buffet ran out. I guess we'll just have to talk more tomorrow. Eh, oh well. Uh-oh. To the future. Another world in which people's distorted cognitions take shape? Stealing treasure to change hearts? And on top of that, a talking cat told you all this. Honestly speaking, that all sounds absurd. It's hard to believe that this is even worth listening to. Still, it can't be considered nonsense when parts of it align with Kamoshida's confession. The same goes for the testimonies of the officers who arrested you. But so be it. At any rate, you mentioned something more important. These two other accomplices, besides this talking cat thing that appeared in your story. From what you've been telling me, they're students at the same school, aren't they? Very well. I'll leave it at that. Let's continue on. There are many more events that I must inquire on. Lies and false accounts are eventually exposed. The next to receive a calling card was this individual. A master of Japanese arts. Ichiryusai Madarame. It's even more incomprehensible than Kamoshida as to why this man was targeted. Where did you come to know him? And how did you learn of his crimes when you weren't a victim of them? Start by telling me what you all schemed. Summary of the story to this point has been updated. To read, press the triangle and go to the story system option. Huh. Hmm. We spent all our money on the buffet, but we officially established the Phantom Thieves, so it's probably worth it. Huh. Phantom Thieves, huh? I'm liking the sound of that. I hope we can really help people. I'm curious about what the Phantom Aficionado website, too. I wonder who made it. No clue! More importantly, you see the survey on there? I don't know how I feel about it. Yeah, there's a bit... There was this approval rating thing, but it was only at a 6%. Better than I expected. I guess it's not so bad if you put it that way. But don't you just want to get it higher than that? I bet it'll go up tons if we keep t taking down big targets. It's pretty dang exciting if you try and think about it like that. You know, you're actually right. Well then, let's keep working hard from this point on. And that will be it today, guys. If you guys enjoyed, please consider giving this video a like. It was a long one, and I know, but thank you for sticking with me. And I appreciate it. Tell your friends. Persona's cool. Uh, yeah. So, I will see you guys tomorrow. I hope I'll you just have a this. fantastic day. I'll see you guys later. Bye bye